Welcome to Jansen Podcast. Not because we mature. Just know that time cannot be turned back. We have grown, we have changed, we have chosen our own paths to walk, we have chosen to leave each other. Growing up is not inherently a problem, we are the ones who decide everything. The girl has a bright smile. I love it when someone calls me that, as well as my own smile. It's not that I'm arrogant or anything like that, it's just that I feel like a smile is the biggest feature on my face. People often think that I am a cold person, difficult to get along with, before I smile at them. I have a very close friend. She is taller than me, has darker hair than me, is better educated than me, has more talents than me, has better relationships with friends than me. It cannot be denied that at times I am very self-deprecating, even Drawing a distance from her, I hate the feeling of being small, the more I hate the underground battles between the two of us. No statement was made, but everyone understood what that meant. Because. We both like the same guy. He studied very well, had a calm personality, and was funny at times. The three of us used to be a close trio, before I understood my heart and saw through my friend's feelings. Now our relationship is very different. Sometimes I think about it, that I should be the one to give up, that's all, everything will be fine. Even if we can't go back to who we were in the past, my withdrawal will bring some comfort to this tangled mess of emotions. The two of them are really compatible. I found myself lost. I don't look like I'm going to be the winner. Of course I'm the one who should give up, isn't it? I threw myself into college prep, creating a tight schedule that didn't leave any room for thinking about them and letting them influence my life. A couple of times she texted me, sort of. Try hard, you'll do it. But don't get sick. I believe she is sincere. At least our five-year friendship wasn't a piece of rotten wood. Besides, I've already left. I entered a prestigious university in a big city. The two of them stayed in the peaceful city where we grew up. The day I left, they came to see me off. It rained a lot that day. Maybe that's why my heart was cold. I avoided looking them in the eye, answered only a few questions and then checked into the waiting room, trying to distract my thoughts with the exciting student life in front of me. In the new city, I quickly made many friends. We often gather to eat, chat, sing karaoke, sometimes take each other to hide somewhere for a few days. I love living like this, I feel free and rebellious, that's exactly what I wished for in my youth. I also had a part-time job, attended some skill classes and fan club. I know many people, have many relationships, many dates and many confessions. Usually I just laugh it off instead of saying no, it's not that I don't have any feelings for them, it's just that I can't accept this kind of love easily. Whatever comes easily will also be